Cindy Griffin, and I'm the women's basketball coach here at St. Joseph's University. Hi, Phil Martelli, head men's basketball coach, St. Joseph's University. I'm Casey Parker, a junior on the women's basketball team. Uh, my name is Michael Galloway, um, part of the men's basketball team. I'm a junior this year. Wow, sounds cool. Um, last season, we had a great season. We won 22 games. Uh, we had two. We had four sensational seniors that really led us the whole, the whole way. Uh, we had some very talented underclassmen, um, and you know we did. We, we went to the second round of WNIT, which is really good for this team. Last season was exciting. Certainly, having the Hagen Arena full for the Temple game, the Villanova game, and the Creighton game, they were exciting moments. We learned that we could excite particularly our student body. We learned that we could play on a national level. And we also have to learn from the disappointments, the 14 losses. In 11 of those 14 losses, we had a lead in the second half. So the coach has to do a better job. The players have to do a better job. And I want everybody that views this to hold us accountable for one thing, finishing. We have so much talent. We're young. You know, we had a lot of seniors graduate last year. We had such talented people came in. We have transfers that are eligible now. So we have a really deep squad this year. Uh, looking forward to this year. I mean, we're all experienced, much older, and um, we're all going to be even better than last year. So. A number of these guys, Langston Galloway, C.J. Aiken, Ron Roberts, Darius Quarles, have all played a lot of minutes since their freshman year. Well now, their college career is half over. Tay Jones has played a lot of minutes since he was a, a, a freshman. Alil Kanasevich, even though this is just his second year here, played a lot of minutes as a freshman at Hofstra. So we have players that have played an awful lot, very, very experienced. And saying all that, we still only have one senior in the rotation in Tay Jones. Well, our goal is going to be to win more games than we did last season. And that's a pretty big goal to have considering how many games we won last season. But I really do think um, that we have what it takes to, to win more games than, than last year's team. Uh, where we need to get better is um, just the little things, just paying attention to detail, the rebounding, the defense, um, setting the screens, all those little things that come with experience, which uh, every game, every practice will help us achieve that. I expect this team to be pretty good early, but I think we're going to be really good at the end of the year. The players' performance is, is impacted by the students. There's no question about it. There's nobody that views this that doesn't want to be liked. And the noise and the energy is a way for the players to feel liked and to, be, to feel appreciated for all the hard work that they do. Uh, keep us pumped up, uh, loud. We love the gym loud. And uh, I mean, it's just always fun to hear the crowd yelling, all kind of different chants. So it is, that's, that's always fun. Everybody wants to be a crowd pleaser. And it's just so much better when you're playing in a gym where you know, everybody's doing for you. And like, the more people, the better. And you know, we get we get hyped. You know? it's, the crowd's loud and everyone's cheering for us. And it's a lot of fun, you know? So the student section will be good. We really need to have a presence, to, to come to every game, um, to really cheer on our, our team, but also, you know, make it known that it's not an easy place to play here at Hagen if you're an opponent, you know? And uh, just the presence of really, you know, 50 students, you know, I'm not asking for 250. If we get 250, that's great, but just 50 on a steady basis to sit underneath the, the basket and, um, and cheer our kids on. This is a great team. We do have a lot of talent. The people who do come to our games are never disappointed. They're not. My personal goals this season is I want to make it to the NCAA tournament. I'm tired of going to the NIT, which is good, but we were so close last year, and I think we can do it this year. That's my goal. I think at the end result, it's going to be very, very good, and I think we all know what the result could be, um, of all the things that uh, we're capable of doing come into play, but I don't want to get ahead of ourselves. I want to take one practice at a time, one day at a time, if you will, and uh, one game at a time. Just to make it to NCAA and, and go from there, that's, that's the main goal. What you can expect from this season is blood, sweat, tears, hugs, joy. You can expect that this student body is going to turn out in record numbers and that this team is going to scrape their knees 
and fight in a very, very difficult Atlantic 10 to make everybody dance in March.